Hi, it's me again. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I was just thinking about how a lot of people, you know, don't seem to be very honest these days. They don't want to face the truth or even be honest themselves. And the way I grew up, I grew up learning how to face my problems head on. And confronting people when necessary. And now I live in a world where a lot of people don't seem to speak up all that much anymore. Even when being confronted, it's like they don't want to deal with me. You know, maybe being a confrontational person that I am sometimes, people, I wonder if they see me as a threat or something like that because, you know, no one ever wants to speak up. And it's just... But I always value relationships based on honesty and people based on honesty. And my rule is, is that I would rather have people be honest with me no matter what. Even if they disagree with me. Even if they don't like me. I'd rather have someone be honest and tell me what they really think about me than to just sit there quiet and never say anything because it makes me wonder about people that never speak up. You know? They, you know, they, they claim that they believe in what they believe in, but they don't speak up. I'm constantly expressing my beliefs. You know, I'm constantly talking about my lo our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and Hey, I know there's a lot of people out there that don't like Christians, and I know a couple of people that are doing things that is completely against God. But, you know, I wonder if they even watch my videos, because I share my videos on my Facebook. Every video I've created on YouTube, I usually share on Facebook, or I do share on Facebook. But a lot of people just don't seem to accept maybe one or two people. The rest of everyone just stays silent. My family, my friends, and I know they're on Facebook all the time. I know they're on there all the time, but yet, they don't seem to have the courage to really, to really, uh, face me. And that's why I'm, I always, uh, like to, uh, record myself, because this is my face. I like to be face to face with people. And in these end times, I think it's important for us to be honest with how we feel because there's going to come a time where we won't have a chance to say what we want to say. You know, everything will be silenced. There won't be any opportunity for family and friends and relationships to say to each other what they need to say before all is silenced. So that's why I'm speaking out because it's good for me and it's good for other people too, especially when I'm sharing my beliefs, my most important beliefs, which is about our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who I believe in very deeply. And, but a lot of people don't want to speak up that I know. You know what? Strangers speak up more than people I know. I feel like, in a weird way, that strangers are more honest with me than people I know in my everyday life and throughout my life. People know me, they see my videos, they see me sharing my beliefs, why don't they ever say anything? Rather they agree with it or not, why don't they ever have the guts to speak up? Because, you know, I want to know people's honest feelings. I want to know what people are thinking in these last days. I want to know who's with me and who's against me. Especially those that are with God and against God. Even more important. I want to know. Because lots of people don't seem to even have the guts, don't even have the guts to confront me. And I wonder why. Do they feel threatened by me? Do they think I'm a complete whack job? Whatever it may be, hey, I'm not here to hurt anyone. I share my beliefs about my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ because He is real. If you accept Jesus Christ into your heart and you read God's Word, I can guarantee the Holy Spirit is going to teach you, and you're going to know He's real. But you know what? 
just like we confess our sins to God, I believe in confessions. I believe in repenting. And I expect that out of people that know me. If people truly love and care about me, then they need to speak up and confess how they really feel about me. Because there's going to come a time when they won't be able to do that anymore. And they want to take things for granted. Right now we have all this wonderful technology. We can connect to each other with this technology. We may not be able to physically be next to each other, but with technology we can still communicate. So why don't they do the same thing? Make a YouTube video and share it. You know? Say what they feel. Say whether they believe in God or not. Whether they love me or hate me. Whatever. I'd rather people be honest. You know what? Sometimes it gets to the point where I feel like, you know what? I think it's better to deal with an honest enemy that can admit that they hate me than to deal with false friends and false family members that, eh, we care about you, Cassie, but yet they truly hate my guts and they think I'm a moron, they think I'm nuts, and they don't have the courage or guts or decency to confront me on it. Because I don't like liars. I don't like people that are not honest. What do they have to lose by speaking up and saying their belief? Because in the end, we're, we're at God's judgment. All our beliefs are going to be out in the books. So why not just be honest? Confess to how you really feel. Rather you agree with me or not, it's okay. You know what? Even if you don't agree with me, even if you hate my guts and you think I'm the biggest moron on planet Earth, you know what? As a Christian, I still love you. I may not agree with you. I may not like you or trust you either. But you know what? Hey, we're living in the end days. And what I really want from people, I don't want their money. I don't want their worldly benefits. I just want them to be honest with me. Say how they really feel. Whether they love me or hate me, agree with me, not agree with me. Because you know what? You know, as a Christian, I believe in strict honesty. It's like, hey, I just want to know. Especially from people that know me. Family and friends that have known me all my life. What are they afraid of? They have nothing to be afraid of. I'm not going to hurt anyone. I'm not going to go after anyone. I'm, I'm a person that I build relationships on honesty. That's how I personally am. I build relationships on truth and honesty. How does a person really feel about me? That's why I'm posting this video. Because a lot of people say they're on my side, and they say they agree with me, but their actions don't really seem to show that they really are on my side. And some people just blatantly go against what I say. So I wonder how they really feel. Are they afraid to confront me? Hey, I'm not like confronting like I want to fight with people. This is just about being honest. This is about honesty. And that's what I expect out of every relationship in my life. Be honest. There's nothing wrong with being honest. It's better to be honest, set yourself free, than to live with secrets in your heart that just completely tear you up. Because you know, you know why I'm making these videos? Because it's time to be honest. It's time to proclaim what I believe in. And I say everyone should do the same thing. While we still have the freedom, while we still have the resources, speak up, speak out. Come on, you know. Take this opportunity, take this privilege to speak out, speak your mind, you know. What do you got to be afraid of? What are you afraid of? Especially to those that know me. What are you afraid of? What do you think I'm going to do if you tell me how you really feel about me? You think I'm going to come after you? You think I'm going to fight with you? Well, let me make this easier for you. No. Because, as a Christian, Christians are about honesty. But I'm not going to hurt anyone. I'm not going to fight with you. I'm going to stick to my guns. 
I'm going to stick to what I believe in, but hey, at least I'll respect you. I'll tell you what, I'll have a lot more respect for you for being honest with me than if you just play with my feelings and my emotions. Just play games all the time. You know, only speaking up to me when it's convenient for you or because you're afraid of being honest. Hey, I got a lot more respect for people that are honest. Even if they say they hate my stupid guts. You know what? That might hurt my feelings. You know, like, oh, well, that's too bad, you know. But I'll have more respect for you than someone who says they love me, but they don't prove it. So come on, folks. Be honest. Come on, it's the end of days. You know, spill out your heart. Say what you feel while they still have the chance before everything is silenced.